Hey guys, thank you so much for tuning into my channel. I promise I will be a little more active with posting different rituals and things that you can do, but I have just been swamped and busy. And But I wanted to hop on here and share with you a very simple ritual that you can do if you are in an emergency or if you are in a time of need where you say need money quickly or anything quickly. And this is simply to make a petition to Saint Expedite. Now there are a couple things that you need to remember when working with Saint Expedite or any deity or saint for that matter. And one of the big ones is if you promise them something and they come through for you, you need to make sure you deliver on your promise. You do not want to be on the receiving end of their anger. Saint Expedite will take back everything from you that he gave you. Um, and this could be big or small, you know, not scare anybody. You may end up losing your life. You could lose, if it's money, you could be flat broke and lose everything. Um, and these are very real instances. So if you promise him something, make sure you deliver. Um, Another thing that I want you to remember, a lot of people will place this photo upside down um, to make him work faster because I want to want to say he was crucified upside down. Don't quote me on that. I'm not 100% certain. Um, but to me, I think that's really disrespectful and it could just potentially anger him and he won't grant your petition. Now, another thing to remember is just because you petition him, it doesn't mean he's going to do it. I've been very fortunate where he has helped me in my time of need <coughs> several times, but there have been one or two times where I've petitioned him and no response. So if you petition him, make sure whatever you're doing, you're actively also trying to solve your situation, trying to work on your situation. And you're just not sitting on your laurels or resting on your laurels waiting for him to come through for you. Faith without works is dead. No matter what you believe, faith without works is still dead. So this ritual is very simple. You're just gonna need a glass of water, a red candle, something bigger than the chime candle. So I just used a small taper candle, a bell, and a photo of St. Expedite. Once you set up your St. Expedite altar, which I will show you in a moment, you are then, um, you're going to light your candle. And if he comes through for you, when your petition is granted, you're going to thank him by red flowers. He loves red roses and pound cake. Um, and you also want to make sure that you thank him publicly. Usually it used to be that you would put it in a newspaper a written petition in newspaper. However, no one really does it anymore. So what I like to do, I will make an Instagram story. I have 33,000, 34,000 Instagram followers. So I will easily just put it on my Instagram story. Who day, H-O-D-I, you can do that. Um, sometimes I'll just post it on my Facebook, who day, because um, not a lot of people know what that means. But if, you know, there will be times that I will explain it. Um, I'll explain it on my Instagram stories or even if you're watching this video and you do this ritual, just simply comment below if he's helped you out. And this is another way to give him public recognition for him coming through for you. So you definitely want to make sure that you thank him um, because he did do something for you. What you don't want to do is do the public recognition, the flowers, the pound cake before he comes through for you. So. He is kind of a trickster. He will take your gifts and not do anything. So just be aware of that as well. Also, for me personally, I just like to keep his photo up. And, you know, sometimes I'll keep an altar set up for him. I'll keep a glass of water out for him just as a, you know, ongoing thing. So it's not that I'm just coming to you when I need something. I'm giving you some kind of recognition, you know, consistently. So that's another thought. Um, as with any deity or any saint, you want to make sure that you're also building a relationship with them. So for me, just leaving his picture up and acknowledging him is a great way to continue to build that relationship with him. So when you do the Saint X, when you light the candle and I'm going to show you how it looks afterwards, 
but you want to make sure that you, let's see, sorry, saying expedite prayer. <laughs> you want to make sure that you actually say, say the St. Expedite prayer after you light it. And I will link a website below that has a different one. So there are different prayers for urgent needs, urgent needs, depending on what you need. So for financial crisis, house and home, for quick help, um, for quick action, desperate causes, intercession and protection, um, whatever it is that you're going, whatever it is that you're requesting or that you need, you want to say it in that you want to say that particular prayer and make sure you are also very specific with what you need. So if you need money, you can say, I need $2,500 to cover my rent or $300 for child care. I need $150 to buy some groceries, $424 for my electric bill. Um, these are things that you just want to say to him. So you're very specific. You don't want to leave it open-ended because like I said, he's a trickster. He, you say you need money. Okay, well, here's 50 cent. That's money. You weren't specific. So just make sure you are incredibly specific with whatever it is that you ask him. Also, when you set it up, like I like to just ring the bell and that gets his attention. So before or after I light my candle, I'll just and say the prayer, I'll just ring the bell or you can do it beforehand just to get his attention um, so that he knows that you are calling on him. So very simple ritual, very quick. I am going to set mine up now so that you can see what it looks like. And that is essentially it for this video. If you have any questions, please drop a comment below and I will answer them. I will also link the prayers, um, all of that in the comments below, um, in the description below. Uh, you don't have to write out a petition for this. Like I said, it's in the prayer. You say it out loud. You don't need to copy the prayer and write it down. Um, there is a very, there is a certain way that you actually need to set this up and I will show you that at the end of this video. Um, but like I said, make sure you, if you promise him something outside of the flowers and the pound cake, just make sure you deliver on it. Make sure you come back to this video, type who day in the comments, thank him publicly wherever you can. And that's it. So subscribe to my channel for more videos. I promise I will try to do weekly rituals on here. Um, I've just been really busy, like I said, but it's close to summer. I'll have a little bit more time in the summer once the kids are out of school. And that's it. I will catch you guys next time. So this is how I set up my altar for St. Expedite. You want to make sure that the picture is in the back. You have a glass of water. The candle is in here. So <laughs> the candle over there and then a bell in the center. So that's fairly simple. I will catch you guys next time.